Ha, ah, hello, beautiful person. Brother, sister, auntie, uncle, Infinity Tribe member, hello. I am recording this video outside and I have a very exciting message for you. If you stick around to the end of this video, I will give you a small gift. I will share a little freestyle rap to reward you to watch for watching towards the end. Otherwise, please forgive any background noise. I'm out here in the neighborhood. It is still the ongoing celebration of Tet, the lunar, lunar New Year, and a lot of partying, a lot of activity, a lot of celebrating. So please forgive any background noise. Anyways, the purpose of this video is for me to talk about a new exciting offering that I feel drawn to to give to the world to create and that is men's gatherings men's circles an opportunity for men to drop in and and connect and to create brotherhood and to share their truth to be seen to support each other to be held accountable to be challenged and I'm just going to tell a little bit of a story about how this type of work has been so impactful in my life and in my journey. I first sat in what's called a men's circle in Chiang Mai in 2017. And it was very challenging at first. I didn't really know what was going on. And looking back, what it was is there's just this deep presence. There's this deep power of this container being, being held in this intentional space for, for talking. And I had never experienced something like that. I, I grew up playing basketball, so I was constantly around men, boys and men and brothers and feeling that connection. But I never really dropped into this, you could call it sacred, but it's really just deep presence with, with a group of men. And it was powerful. And I didn't really know what was going on because it was so challenging and triggering for my mind. I wanted to kind of analyze and judge and, and the silence was uncomfortable, so I wasn't sure what to do though I just I kept coming back there's something in me that just said this is powerful I, I need more of this I'm curious and if you're like me whenever something challenges me I usually see that as an opportunity for growth I, I want more of that because I know that it's going to help me grow into a better person and be the best version of myself so that was in 2017 and since then I've participated in various numbers of, of men's circles and men's programs both both online and in person and I really I've gotten so much value out of them I have also worked with coaches men and women and healers and spiritual counselors and psychotherapists but there's something so powerful about sitting in a group and I receive so much just by, by being in the presence of, of other men and in their shares I have an opportunity to look inside and see how it resonates with me and it's, it's this beautiful healing process where I get to learn about myself while also witnessing someone else and it's just been so beautiful. It's, it's way cheaper than therapy. I also think it's way more fun as well. I've been a part of an online um, group with with two of my best friends from the United States originally it started as a mastermind we were all growing businesses and keeping each other accountable and then over the years it's evolved to be to be a space for us to share everything whether that is things that are going on in our personal life our relationships our sex life triggers within our family how our business is doing you know really honoring the fact that just because we are in a male body doesn't mean that our emotional needs aren't important and so oftentimes we are sharing from the heart and it's this beautiful space of, of love and and acceptance and compassion other times we we challenge each other and, and give each other advice and and push each other to our limits so that we can we can grow as as a group so it's been super impactful and powerful for me on my journey and recently I've been a part of an online training um, the unmasked man's unmasked man men's circle facilitation training and it's been incredibly powerful it's super transformational I'm learning so much I'm growing I'm, I'm, I'm on my edge every single day and for me I love that as uh, 
you know, as that masculine energy. And if, if you've been to any of our events or met me in person, you know I, I like the ice bath, I like the breath work, I like peak states, you know, psychedelic journeys, all these things, closing the eyes, going into the unknown and, and that penetration energy. And so it's just been super valuable for me to experience this energy. And I feel very inspired to bring this out to, to the world. So, so that is what I'm doing. I'm creating an online men's gathering. We're going to start by meeting once a week. The time may change, but for now it's 10 a.m. Vietnam time. And I just want to make this video to explain a little bit about my journey and, and why I'm doing this. So it's not just this random offering of, hey, here I got a new idea, come and join. But really to, to share my experience and how much I've gained from these types of, of, of spaces and and how exciting it is for me to bring this out into the world so a little bit about the space of course i'm going to include a link to the facebook event wherever this video is posted so you can check out and read more if you're interested but essentially it's just a group of men coming together and and sharing what's true and taking off our masks of of who we think we should be or who our parents think we should be or what society thinks we should do and just being extremely honest with ourselves and with other men. And it's an opportunity to give and receive support, to step into your role as a facilitator or just mirror someone, to be that supportive brother, paternal role in someone else's life, and also to receive from another man, to receive feedback, to receive challenge, to receive questions, and to do this all in a safe container so that we can all feel like we're in this together, so we can move as a group, so we can challenge each other with that heartfelt intention. Where often, in my experience, you know, sports or athletics or other areas of competition can, can be a little bit intense for me. I'm so sensitive, I have such a, a tender heart. So growing up playing basketball, yeah, I know it came from love during practice when they pushed me and pushed me, but sometimes, I just felt like they were abusing me and, and I didn't really feel safe. So it's, it's a safe container. It's, it's a place where you can be seen and, and loved and accepted for everything that you are and challenged to, to grow, to, to strip away any layers of confusion or illusion or insecurity that are getting in your way. And just come together and be honest and, and grow together as a group. So there's an aspect of sharing. We're all gonna share going to connect, give feedback. We may do some breath work, some meditation. I don't have the exact format planned. I like to open up and see what inspiration uh, guides me to do. But I am sure that this is just going to be a space for amazing people, for men who, who are ready to integrate their mind into their heart and, and, and move forward into this world in a more beautiful way and to, to step into their purpose, to be honest with themselves around their finances, their sex life, their work-life balance, their physical health, their diet, their addictions, their sleep, and, and all these other things that we all share in common, but it's not so typical to discuss these things if we're going out to the bar, or at a pub, or at a networking event. It can take uh, a lot of balls uh, to bring out these topics in a, in a social environment that's not intentional. So I'm creating this space so that we can be intentional, so we can drop into these deeper patterns and deeper struggles that are alive in us so we can work through them together in a safe and empowering way. So if this calls to you, please check out the link. Please let me know if you plan on attending. If you have any questions, I would love to see you there. This is not the first and last time I'm going to do an event like this. This plans to be a continuous journey where I will evolve around the men who feel called to join. So please stay in touch. And if you have any friends or one brother that you feel would be interested in this type of, of work and setting and could grow, please send this video or tag them and, and make sure that they, they feel the love and support from you. Otherwise, I hope to see you there. Um, let's see if there's anything else that wants to come through did not expect this video to be this long. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, the word that's coming up is just open. This is just an open space for men to come and join. And it is for men only. And to me, that is not a, 
if you're in a male body, to me, masculinity, it's, it's just an energy. And, and for this, perhaps someday we, we'll open it up for, for women as well. But for now, it's just for men. And just open. If, if, this is, if it feels open for you watching this video, then it's probably a resonance. And, and you would probably get a lot of value out of it. If you notice your body is tightening and you're in your head and you're worried and you have a bunch of questions that you need to get answered before you feel safe and comfortable to move forward with this event, then it's probably not a good fit right now and that, that's totally fine. I'm not here to persuade you, but this is an open space. If you wanna come and experience that openness to learn to open your mind and open your heart and open up to the universe and to whatever the universe wants you to, to, to do and to be and to become in this world, then please, please, please uh, check it out and I hope to see you at this online men's gathering. Otherwise, I'll see you around. Thank you for watching this video. Again, any questions, just uh, send me a message. And as I promised, freestyle rap at the end of this video. So I'll take a few breaths and then I'll give you a little outro flow. All right. <sighs> Yo, here we go drop the flow jg saying goodbye or hello alo ha peace and shalom i'm here in vietnam it is my home freestyling after my talk on men's gathering you know it's happening we all are rapping <laughs> ripening like a fruit on an apple tree because we all just want to be the true essence of who we're meant to be whether that means tapping into our masculinity or femininity it's all divinity and within us all it leads to infinity so if you want to have this journey with me then click the link below and one two three you will see what's gonna happen and together we can all evolve as sisters and brothers and brothers and cousins and mothers and fathers and daughters hear the water in the background as I spit this sacred sound my feet are on the ground but my heart has no bounds it's not binded nah it's expansive and I want you to join me so we can just dance with the infinite creativity coming from within so maybe you're in maybe you're out it's all good release all the doubt I'm not gonna shout I'm just gonna love I'm gonna creep in below and above, give you a shove. Nah, that's not my flavor. I don't engage in that type of behavior. Instead, I just kick back and chill for a while. So I'm ending this freestyle with a big JG smile. Peace. Drop the mic. <laughs>